Then he shall put his hand on the head of the burnt offering, and it will be accepted on his behalf to make atonement for him. Leviticus, chapter 1, verse 4. If by that laying on of his hand the bullock became the offer sacrifice, how much more shall Jesus become ours by the laying on of the hand of faith? My faith doth lay her hand on that dear head of thine, while like a penitent I stand, and there confess my sin. If a bullock could be accepted for him to make atonement for him, how much more shall the Lord Jesus be our full and all-sufficient propitiation? Some quarrel with the great truth of substitution, but as for us, it is our hope, our joy, our boast, our all. Jesus is accepted for us to make atonement for us, and we are accepted in the Beloved. Let the reader take care at once to lay his hand on the Lord's completed sacrifice, that by accepting it, he may obtain the benefit of it. If he has done so once, let him do it again. If he has never done so, let him put out his hand without a moment's delay. Jesus is yours now if you will have him. Lean on him, lean hard on him, and he is yours beyond all question. You are reconciled to God, your sins are blotted out, and you are the Lord's. Amen.